A Republican congressional candidate that some are saying is the Sarah Palin of the South, her name is Lenar Whitney, has now said that uh, climate change is a hoax, first and foremost. First, let me give you a little bit of a flavor of, of the flavor of her campaign ad. Check this out. Recently, in my announcement speech for Congress here in Louisiana, I said something very provocative. I said that global warming is a hoax. Naturally, liberals in the lamestream media became unglued and attacked me immediately. But as George Orwell once wrote, in the time of universal deceit, telling the truth is a revolutionary act. A specter is haunting America. It is perhaps the greatest deception in the history of mankind. It has been almost 10 years since failed presidential candidate Al Gore put out his propaganda film, The Inconvenient Truth. But most importantly, she fleed an interview where she was simply asked, what's your view about President Obama's birth certificate? Uh, she was interviewed by David Wasserman, OK, from the Cook Political Report. And he asked about what do you think of President Obama being a natural born U.S. citizen? She replied it was a matter of some controversy. And then two campaign consultants of hers quickly whisked her out of the room, accusing David Wasserman of conducting a Palin style interview. Apparently, a Palin style interview is where the questions are incredibly simple and straightforward to the point where you're expected to just respond with your opinion or fact. And that apparently is too much. It was certainly too much for Sarah Palin when she was asked to just list something that she reads and clearly too much here, Lewis, for Lenar Whitney as well, running out of the room. And in her in her little uh, infomercial for herself or yeah. whatever you want to call it, uh, she makes all these false claims about uh, she says that the temperature has been getting colder, been getting colder. Uh, collectively around the earth. It's it's incredible, David. The entire story of Lenar Whitney is the same as a parody of the right wing, right? The way she speaks is a complete parody of Sarah Palin, seemingly. The uh, uh, explanation she gives on climate change, the ad, a complete parody. The uh, reaction when she's asked about Obama being a, a natural born citizen, being whisked out of the room as if she's just been sandbagged in some way. It's indistinguishable from a parody of the right wing. This is you could run this on Saturday Night Live and people wouldn't know the difference if you had video of this exchange from an actual SNL skit. I know it is. It's like she's a joke. I mean, she is a joke, but she doesn't think she's a joke. Uh, but uh, we can laugh about it, I guess. Let's take a break. Next, I will talk to Ted Brower, who thinks that the Ebola infection concerns from the U.S. Mexico border are a real significant issue. That's next.